head. like underwears or like stuff in my bag. Um, I was in San Antonio and um, I was on a ride and I felt like it coming and I was wearing shorts. So it was like, uh, I was like, uh, I need to get off this ride. And I was on the ride with it on and I, I get off the ride, I'm like staying, so I have to go change. And it was like, it was the worst because we were at Six Flags. So I was like, mm, no, I was like, no. So I don't really ever actually, like, I'm very like light. I just have like bad cramps. But um, there was one time where I went to Subway and I like didn't know I was getting my period because I came like super early that month. And I like remember like feeling it, but I was like, you know, I'm, there's no I'm getting my period. Yeah. Like it's too early in the month. And I like go in Subway and like the line was so long and everybody was staring at me. And I was like, why is everyone staring at me? And then Jazzy, she goes, Danny, look at your pants. Like literally, like when I say like, it must have been like bleeding for like two hours straight. Like it was all the way down to here. Really? Like all like that, like you could see through my butt, everything. It was so <laughs> embarrassing. It's so so I go and I'm just like, I'm just gonna leave. <laughs> I would leave home. too. And it sucked because those are my favorite jeans and I have fun with them. Have you ever smoked weed, vaped, etc.? Nope. I've never smoked weed. But I made it once and I'm pretty sure everyone knows that. But other than that, no. I don't know, no. I feel like it's such like a common thing for people to make though. Even though it's not like good for you, people still do it. But I've never done it actually. I okay, I have done um what's it called? Those monkey like where you breathe in the as no, I don't know what they're called. But it's like an essential oil machine that you breathe in and it makes it look like you're smoking. But um someone I don't talk to anymore got it for me because he was just like, oh, like, 
you'll like it. And I was like, took like one like little like breathe in of it and I was like, ew. <laughs> I don't like this. <laughs> it was weird. But it was just essential oil, so it wasn't anything bad. Embarrassing moment together. Do we even have one? Do we have one? I don't think we do. I feel like we just always have fun together. That's the thing. And it's like yeah. never. We never really have like yeah. an embarrassing moment. Not an embarrassing moment, but there's times where this girl right here likes to. I don't like to pick fights, but when yeah. people like to pick fights with Danny because they know who she is, I'm gonna stick up for her because Danny's not the right person to stick up for herself either. Like she stays quiet. So. Yeah, I just don't even but I'm like, okay. Bye. There was one time that Desi was like ready to fight this girl, <laughs> and like the security guard had to like pull off. I was like, what? The <laughs> okay. <clears throat> All right. Your friend stole. Oh my gosh, you guys stole something from the stores at Tarpon Point. Oh my gosh, we were walking, and remember you said I stole this mask. It was on a table, it was like tucky, it was like a bunch of them, so I just took one and walked out the store. And I was like, I stole it! That's so funny that that person is standing right there. That's what crazy. the heck? Okay. What's the worst thing you lied about to get out of trouble? I don't even know. There was one time where I like snuck out <laughs> of like uh, my dad's. <laughs> Because like Danny sneaking out what? It wasn't bad. It was literally just to go see my friend that lived down the street. Like it was a girl. Mm -hmm. Like literally a girl. So it wasn't that bad. But I was like really bored and like I don't know. Like he was like, no, you can't go out. And I was like, so I just like went through the back and just like went over there really quick and I was like, hey, and I was over there for like 30 minutes and I came back and then um yeah. He never found out. But like one day he asked me. Uh -huh. I think he like saw it on my screen and he's like, Were you with this girl? And I was like, no. I was like, that's <laughs> no. a long time ago. So I lied about that to get myself out of trouble. I know, it was like weird. Like I never, I've never snuck out, but I, I did that. Time. I snuck out with my brother, my two, of, both my brothers, because I have two brothers, but I snuck out with both of them. I did not sneak out with nobody, but both of them. And one of his, my older brother's friends, and a friend of mine, a friend of, well, not, he's not my friend anymore, but you know, I don't talk anymore. Um, well, he picked us up and it was him and then his, cousin and it was me and my brothers in the back with his friend and um we went to Whataburger. Whataburger is like outside like right in front of my neighborhood so we went to Whataburger, and my brother and his friend decided to get out the car and just be in the parking lot next to the movie theater because there's a movie theater next to our neighborhood and the cop stopped them so we went home we had to go we, me and my brother went to go get dropped off me and the little one went to go get dropped off and then the police was like, you have to call your parents to come pick you up because you're not supposed to be out here. Because my, my brother was pretty young. Um, so, but he's 17 now. But um, yeah, she was like, I, was, I had to tell her, I was like, uh, can you go pick, I had to go wake her up. I was like, you have to go pick up Edward because he got caught from the cops from sneaking out. And she was like, did you sneak out? I was like, no, I didn't sneak out. I was like, no. And then she checked with the cameras and then she found out. But I had like. Wait, her. they have cameras in the house. And we still in the house. And we had alarms too. But that that day, my mom, my parents forgot to set the alarm on, and we opened the door, and they didn't wake up, so we left. So it was pretty easy. But now wow. they set it every night, so we're kind of. Well, that's like good, I guess. She wasn't even that mad. <laughs> have you ever catfished someone? No. Me either. I've never catfished someone actually. It would be like, okay, it would be fun, but at the same time, it would be so messed up. Yeah, and it's so like. So that's like why I would never, like, do it. Like, imagine getting catfish. That'd be, like, embarrassing in a way. Yeah, I have been. Like, not by, like, you know, uh -huh. but, like, it was by, like, someone, like, pretending to be, like, a follower of me. Mm -hmm. I don't know, it's a weird situation. But it wasn't, like, someone that I was, like, interested in. Like, it was someone, like, pretending to be, like, a really big fan of me. Mm -hmm. So. Who will have kids first? Danny for sure. Definitely me. Danny I feel like sure. Desi will like want to have like the party life and she's like yeah. in her 20s and me I want to have like the mom life. Yeah. Definitely. At first I don't, I like kids but I don't really want any of my own. 
Will you drink when you turn 21? How do you feel about Mikey drinking around? So I guess this goes for like getting into a future. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, so Mikey, the only reason why he drinks is because, well, he doesn't drink unless he's in Puerto Rico because Puerto Rico is legal to drink Rico there age, at yeah. 18. Um, I don't really mind it. I mean, sometimes Mikey is a little much. He's a little too high for it. <laughs> like, as Desiree, he was getting way too crazy in Puerto Rico, singing in front of people. I don't know. Literally. But I mean, I don't really care as long as he's having, having fun. Like, it's not like he's like an angry drunk or something. But like, he's like throwing stuff at me or something like that, you know. He's, he's just like has fun. Um, hmm, why are you drinking when I'm 21? Probably. I mean, I don't really think that I'll like be like clubbing and stuff drinking, but I would definitely like drink wine with every meal just because wine is like so like elegant. <laughs> I just like, love it. I'm pretty sure I would drink when I turn 21. The I'm pretty thing, sure everyone will. Yeah, right? Like, at least try everyone it. Everyone wants to try it. But the first thing I'll do when I turn 21, like, my bucket list is to go wine tasting in Napa Valley. Oh, that would be, oh my gosh, so fun. We could go together. Uh huh. But yeah, I'm pretty sure I would drink. And with Diego, I mean, he's at the age where he should know better. To, yeah. like, you know, and to, like, where he can stop himself. As long as he knows how to, you know, control himself and like he's at an age where he should know better so i mean i don't mind as long as he's uh this one's pretty interesting if like you and your cousin like each other do you think it's good to date your cousin or have sex no not uh, at all <laughs> yeah i mean if you like your cousin i really think you should probably not yeah i don't um, think that's i don't think it's the best it idea yeah um it's not my place to speak on, but since you asked, I'm gonna tell you. Maybe, no. maybe change who you like. Maybe yeah. find like a boy from your school or something. Like out of everyone, your cousin, yeah. your cousin. Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> okay. You and Des ever fight? Yeah, all the time. Yeah, we fight like every day. Like we pull each other's hair. Yeah, like literally oh. full out. No, I'm just joking. <laughs>